Sudden adult death syndrome is a term used to describe a sudden death in an apparently young and healthy individual who, in, in whom subsequent post-mortem analysis and a toxicology screen, that is, screening for drugs that may cause sudden death, comes back negative. So no obvious cause is identified. This is far greater than one would expect in young people because young people are the epitome of the healthiest segment of our society and one wouldn't expect a young person to die. Uh, so what my message to the ambulance men will be is that they ever take a 999 call for a young person that's collapsed, not to assume it's just drugs or alcohol. This may be a serious fatality which may require immediate cardiopulmonary resuscitation uh, because these conditions are invariably fatal if resuscitation isn't started immediately. The second point I should uh, make is that not everybody that is a victim of sudden death presents with a collapse. Some may present with an unexplained drowning or an unexplained road traffic accident or even an epileptic fit because if the heart's not working well the brain doesn't get blood and one of the features of the brain not getting blood is an epileptic fit. So in many cases we may not be able to save the victim, but an unexpected road traffic accident, an unexplained drowning, should make the paramedic staff consider a disorder such as an electrical fault of the heart. And this is important because these conditions are hereditary and other members of the family may also be affected. If the paramedic doesn't alert a physician to this, then these deaths are then attributed wrongly to death in a road traffic accident or death during drowning and other members aren't screened necessarily.